Grant and I have been looking for about a year, I guess, for maybe longer, for a film to direct and produce. And, uh, and I remembered this one, and I literally pulled the old script out of a pile of, you know, covered in dust in, in my closet and pulled it out and we called up the boys and said, you mind if we take a spin with this script and see if we can uh, change it and move it around a little bit. And they said, you know, fire away. And they were great about it. So that was, and that was about a year and a half ago, I guess. I was afraid Matt was going to show up looking like he could take care of himself. And uh, he showed up and he was already, you know, a little fleshy. And uh, he ate, I don't know, how many hundreds of bags of Doritos on the set. And he got fleshier and fleshier as the, uh, as the shoot went on, which was really fun. We actually talked to her later because we knew it was going to take longer to shoot. And we said, you know, if you don't want to do it, if you feel like it's gimmicky... Um, then we'll just hire another actor for it. She's like, hell no. Yeah, she actually played a twin on a soap opera. So she'd done it before. But it was her idea to dye her hair blonde uh, to look like her sister. And I think that actually was a really great character moment that really tells you a lot about who she is and what her character is. Mi devi aiutare! Oh, Nikki. Basta! Leva dritto in galera, amico. Vieni a casa, vieni a Suburbicon.